It's food o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. It's been a while, but we're back with another episode of Weird Food in a Tin. This is episode seven, believe it or not. I'm going to try and do more of these as they come about. Or when I can find the stuff, really. This is Heinz Spaghetti Plus Sausages. And I just thought, how will that work? Beans and sausages, yeah, we all love beans and sausages. Well, I do anyway. On toast with loads of butter, love beans and sausages. But beans, sorry, spaghetti and sausages in a rich tomato sauce. That's a bit different, isn't it? So, without further ado, I'm going to crack these open. Get it into a glass and see what we get. I mean, get it into a saucepan, make some toast, get it on a plate and see what we get. Well, they smell all right. Look at that. Jellified sausage and spaghetti. Right, okay, I'm gonna get cooking. Next time you'll see me is when it's all on the plate. Okay, we're all set to go. Let's grab these beans and sausages that have just been cooked up. Got some nice toast as well on the go. Bit of, bit of white. Bread with lots of butter, and I gotta be honest, nearly got this wrong. Then I just thought, you know, this thought of this sort of thing. It is weird. It is weird, isn't it? What have we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We've got eight sausages here. Get it there, you'll be able to see it better. Eight sausages. Spaghetti. Toast. But it's a quick lunch. It's a quick lunch. My kids love this sort of thing. They really do. I remember being on holiday once with my dad, my mother, and I think my mum went swimming with my sister, and I ended up being with my dad, and, he, and, and you know, holidays can be expensive times, can't they? We'd been out having meals every night and, and that sort of thing, and he just said to me, should we go back to the caravan and have a quick beans on toast for dinner? Quick as you like, job done, and we did. And we had a chat and we had a laugh and it was one of the, you know, nicest holiday meals I had because not through taste or anything like that, but just because I spent a couple of hours with my dad and we had a good chat and, you know, put loads of brown sauce on it. But it is, I must admit, it is slightly weird to get it in a tin. It's like, um, it's that semolina type spaghetti. It's not like, um, you're not going to get that type of thing anyway, but it's not like an Italian type of spaghetti in a tin. Very sweet. Very, very sweet tasting. We're seeing it's one of your five a day on the tin because it's got a whole tomato into every portion, which is pretty cool, I suppose. Let's have a look at the sausage, which you're probably all looking for. There's a look at the sausage there. Mm, very, very kind of pasty. Very pasty. There's the uh, let's 
get out of the way and see if we can get it to focus. There's the, there's the middle of it there. Yes, yeah, like a funny, like a funny paste. The sausage. But a really quick meal. So, why is it weird, and does it qualify for being weird? I don't know. Actually, I'm I'm in a bit of like a conundrum as to whether it's really that weird. Like we did the hamburgers, hamburgers in a tin. That was weird. What else did we do? I can't remember. It was like. I haven't had a chance to do a weird food in a tin for ages. But I really like making the videos. I loved, absolutely loved, reading your comments on the, uh, the baked beans and sausages in a tin. Because they were like, what? You're reviewing that? Lots of people in shock. I don't know, it's, will this, this, well, I haven't even got to answer the question. Will this fill you up if you had the whole chin to yourself? Absolutely. On two slices of bread? Absolutely, this will do you for dinner. Is it the greatest meal in the world? Absolutely not. Will it do on a Tuesday lunchtime, as I am here right now? Where I don't want to do, you know, overly fancy stuff. I want something quick and easy. Absolutely. I'd love to know. In fact, I'm going to know. Oh, I got, um, oh no, it's gone. Oh, blimey. Got a bit, bit of spaghetti between the drip tray. There we go. Right. Don't want to waste any, do I? So the, it is semolina, a Durham wheat semolina, and the pork sausages are 15% of the whole thing, and it's 55% pork. They're 55% pork, so it's like a mushed, mashed up kind of pork sausage that we have here. Mm. It's filling me up. It's a little bit sweet. It's a little bit semolina like. It's got it's got a whole tomato squeezed into this thing. One of my five a day. It's not the tastiest thing I've ever had in my life. It never will be. In fact, I meant might never eat this type of thing again. But it's quick and easy. So, Rachel. <clears throat> Heinz spaghetti plus sausages. Rate him for this then. It does everything that it says on the tin. Quick, easy, bang, job done. This took me no more than four minutes to knock up. Toast one in the toaster, this one in the saucepan, poured it on hot, knife and fork, bang, four minutes you're in. Is it going to fill me up? Yeah. Never going to be the best thing I've eaten, never will be, Never, probably never buy it again. See, it's worth a, it's, it's, it's worth a six out of ten though, it's worth a six out of ten. Hope you liked the video, it's a bit of fun on the channel, um, we try not to take ourselves too seriously. Um, who else in the world has reviewed high tomatoes, sausages and spaghetti in a tin? Who else has done that? Never take yourself too seriously in life. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beard and food reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! Cheers!